<clears throat> okay. When I used my webcam, I ended up recording like three times trying to get one that works. Um, three times. This is probably like my fifth time this time. Um, I'm going to do the perfect imperfections tag. I think the original person who made it was Andrea's Choice. Um, but the first person I saw do it was XXZ. X C Z X and she didn't know whether the purpose was um for it to be physical things you don't like and like about yourself. Um so she did it differently. Um and I think I'll do it both ways. I've had a cold for weeks, and I'm, I am beating it. The last video I had to stop because I started coughing so bad. But I am beating it. Oh my goodness. What a mess. Look at her, what a mess. Um, my bed's not made. I'm not sure if you can see that, but... Yeah. Washing sheets. And so now that mess is on my mattress. Fun cleaning later. Okay. <coughs> um, so I think I'll do the um the physical things first. Uh three things I like are my Flintstone feet. Um, one of the videos I watched, uh, one of the girls said she, she didn't like that. Um, she was picked on it for it as a child. And um, when, when somebody makes a comment about her feet, she gets emotional about it. Um, I don't think I, I, I guess I never was picked on for it. People called, said I had Flintstone feet, but I never felt like it was an insult. Or if it did feel like an insult, it was one of those, I don't care, water off the duck's back. <coughs> um, so I, I like my feet. I'm not really sure why. I know they're not what people who obsess over feet consider cute, but I like them. Um, I like that I'm short. Um, and I like my chest. Um, it's difficult to find bras in the right size. But, um, uh, I guess with, um, I don't know. <laughs> one of the other videos I recorded, I, I said, I guess I'll probably never want a boob job. I don't know if that's true or not. But whatever. I'm happy with it now. Um, yeah. <coughs> um, things I don't like. Um, and along with being short, I'm kind of short and stubby. I don't really like being stubby, but I can deal with it because I, I like being short. I know not all short people are short and stubby, but I am. And I'm learning, I'm learning to like it, I guess. Um, okay. Things I don't like, other than the ones I already, like, mentioned that went with the things I liked. I do not like my nose. I don't know if you can see it. It's like bulby on the end. I don't know. I know right now it's kind of chapped and ugly. <coughs> uh, it's bulbousy on the end. If I drew a cartoon of myself, I'd have like a ball on the end of my nose, like a clown nose. I don't like that. Um. 
something that didn't bother me when it started happening is um, my age spots. Ooh. See here? Um, they was probably started like four or five years ago. <coughs> oh, I am getting better. Um, yeah, they probably started, yeah, four or five years ago, and I just kind of was like, oh, another beauty mark, whatever, and for years before that, people were telling me I needed to take better care of my skin, and I didn't listen, so that's what I get from not listening, and I still should take better care of my skin, but I don't. Everything that works seems, like, really oily, and I don't like that. Um, if I wore makeup, it would be hidden, I guess, but I don't. So, I guess they don't bother me bad enough that I cover them up, but then I don't want the expensive makeup, because I've never worn it before anyway. <coughs> Anyways, moving on. Something else I don't like is I'm lopsided. Not only are my breasts lopsided, which I'm learning to deal with, but my eyes are too. This one. This one. So confusing looking in the camera. This one is smaller, and I feel like my eyes look like they're little beady eyes when they, they're both small but this one is smaller and they're also like I don't know which way though <coughs> okay and then on to the non-physical things I like and don't like um I like my creativity I see things in think I could do that. A lot of times I don't. But I can sew. I can crochet. I can do beadwork. Oh no, Estrella. Don't eat my headphones. Especially with that nasty cracker all over you. Um. <coughs> Sit back up, please. I don't need that mess. I don't, I don't want that mess anywhere else. Just gotta stay there. Um, I like my style. To me, it's kind of one of those obvious things. Like, if, if you don't like your style, change it. Um, I know where we live, people probably look at me all the time and think I'm some sort of nutcase. Um... Um. <coughs> and again, I didn't write down my third thing I like about myself. Um. Shh. I have no idea. I come up with several different things and never written them down that I have everything else written down I like what do I like about myself I like I guess um oh my ability to um kind of judge a book by its cover um if I have like an instant feeling about someone um, I'm normally right. Well, pretty much, I can't think of a time I've been wrong. Sometimes they fool me for a couple years. Like, I think, oh, I was wrong about them. But a couple of people that I knew of that kind of made me think, oh, I was wrong about them, eventually they turned out like I thought they would be. Um... 
and then the things I dislike about myself. I'm lazy. That's why um, some of my creativity is <coughs> um, never, I never go through with it or I never finish it. I'm a procrastinator and I uh, sometimes, yeah. What are you doing? You're getting all wild. Um, are you getting tired? Another thing I dislike is, I don't dislike the fact that I'm shy, but I dislike um, the way people perceive me because I'm shy. <laughs> I can see it on people's face mm. when I don't, I'm not good at talking with people, and I can tell, like, they think I'm, well, stuck up or snooty because I'm not talking to them, but really, if I don't have anything to say, I'm not going to say anything. I'm uncomfortable talking to them in the first place. <coughs> um, and I dislike how judgmental I can be. My mom taught me very well, along with Bambi. If you don't have something nice, don't say anything at all. And I'm generally pretty good about not saying anything, but the thought is still there. Um, and I know, like, reading on forums and stuff, uh, sometimes I get, like, this really frustrated feeling about someone and how they say something. And really, I don't know them. I don't know what's going on in their life. I don't know how their day went. And I know that I might make the same post on a bad day and might look back if and not, if I didn't know it was me, feel the same way. <coughs> so I need to be less judgmental. <coughs> you feel better? <coughs> That's all, I guess. You're tagged. Yeah. You.